What the fu- Hey guys, welcome back to more Last Stop. So, we are set to play the chapter 2 of Stranger Danger in this video. Now, we see some connections between all the people, but honestly, there is no real connection between them yet. So, I'm still not sure how it's all gonna come together in the last chapter. But anyways, let's get started. Alright, Stranger Danger, let's go. The prisoner. The prisoner. <laughs> Look at me just trying to sneak out. <laughs> okay. I think it's this way. I am not sure whether it's left or right. But I'm just running. Okay. All right, all right. So I have to reach Vivek's place, talk to Emma, and then come back. I guess that's the plan, as far as I remember. Um, here she is. Right. This is not on. You told Mum you'd text her. You didn't. You said you'd be at the Vex house. You weren't. Oh my God. I'm worried about you, Donna. Is everything okay? Just a moment, Ash. I'm not finished. Where the hell were you, Donna? Where are your friends? What prevented you giving us even a courtesy text? Oh my God. I know. I'm a screw up. I had to come out here this late. I have work in the morning. Mum's got enough on her plate. You were out with Vivek again, right? Where is he? Uh -huh. He's still at youth club. You're lying again. Oh, shit. I wonder how Vivek's dad feels about his son staying out all hours. Why don't I ask him while we're here? I bet he'll appreciate me knocking on his door in the middle of the night. Come on. We shouldn't bother Vivek's dad. He's poorly. He's got, um, gingivitis or, <laughs> or something. Babe, it's pretty late. Perhaps we should all just go home. Oh, perfect. My fiance's taking your side now. <laughs> I don't know what's happened with you, Donna. You're always in your head. You're never at home. You never help around the house. Okay, I get it. I'm a total screw up. Are you happy now? Let's just talk about oh my god fine i've done all i can you two can sort it out amongst yourselves all right that went well that went very very can well come on a bit strong at times but she loves you she has your best interests at heart i mean i know ash can we please just drop it though you seem a bit anxious has something happened? Mm. Just tired. I'm not your sister. I'm not going to ask where you were. But you can always tell me if you're in trouble. Ah, that is so sweet. I promise. That is very sweet, man. <laughs> Aren't I supposed to go I back? Sister, I just want us all to be safe and get along. Uh, yep, sounds good. You're sure nothing happened tonight? There's nothing wrong? I mean... A hundred percent. Okay. I don't know, man. I don't yes, know. Should I tell her? I get a scolding too. <laughs> I mean, I left. I don't understand. Aren't they still there? Please text back. What's happening? 
Okay, so there is Becky. No one is responding. Uh... Oh my god. I don't know, man. Oh shoot, so they did not respond to me till morning. Or did they? This is actually worrying. So I'm assuming I'm going there. To check on them because they are not freaking responding to me. For some freaking reason. <laughs> Okay, am I crossing the road? No. Said I haven't heard back from Vin. He's probably with Becky. Do you think Shaggy? Definitely. Okay, so that's Wendy. She's obviously in the same school because she has the same uniform. Wait, what? Where am I supposed to go? Okay. Seen that Bill and Wendy are going out together. I thought they were already seeing each other. No, they've been seeing each other for a bit, but now they're actually going out. Bill's so everyone's just chill. What oh, the hell? That will last. Thought you guys were dead. How can you <laughs> <text> me back? <laughs> we had to go off the grid. I smashed my phone so they couldn't use my GPS. What the hell? My phone's out of battery. How did it go with your sister? Uh. No problem. You know Emma. She's just full of hot air. Has he said anything? Not a peep. He just sat there staring at us. Pretty weird. I didn't dare. I speak. mean, I don't trust Viv's not tying skills. Hey, can't believe how tired I am. Did you bring any food? Uh, sorry. Oh, no. Sorry, guys. I didn't think. Okay, let's get some supplies. We could do with tying the fella up a bit more securely. Oh my God. Sounds good. I could do with a second breakfast. I'll come with. Hang on, that's bullshit. You just got here. <laughs> you stay and me and Viv go. It's cool. I'll watch him. You both go and bring back some food and some zip ties or something. Uh, okay. All right. Whatevs. Be on, cool. Already. I'm getting hangry. So, you and Vivek stayed up the entire night. What did you get up to? You didn't mention anything <laughs> about me to your sister last night, yeah? Of course not. Just, it was self-defense, yeah? And he's not dead or anything, so it's not even a crime, really? Well, you haven't died up, so... Don't worry, I didn't say anything. It was Viv's idea to tie him up, and if you hadn't got stuck on that fence or whatever, we wouldn't even be in this situation. I mean, I guess, but still, man. I... <sighs> Guess we're not going to school today. Screw school, it's the least of our problems. I agree, that is actually the least of the problems. So what are we getting again? Some stuff to tie the guy up with and some sort of weapon. Yeah, uh, why don't you leave the talking Why to are we getting a weapon though? As if I would actually say it like that. We would get some food, right? Maybe it's here? I don't know where. Is it here? Yeah. Alright, alright. Uh, can you move? <laughs> Hi, can I have a Stanley knife, uh, a roll of duct tape, and a bunch of double thick zip ties? <laughs> How old are you? Should you two be in school? <laughs> <laughs> it's a teacher training day. Mm, right. Wear your school uniform every day, do you? I mean... All right, you got us. We're bunking school. We're building a computer from scratch, and we need some zip ties to hold the cables together, and the knife to cut it. I mean, Bravo. that seems believable. But you know you have to be 18 to buy a knife. What? You didn't know that? I don't want to be rude. <laughs> Just testing you. All right, we'll take the other stuff. You have to still get food, right? Oh, well. Oh, it's fine. I nicked all that stuff when we first walked in there. Just oh, shit. Oh, you little thief! Come on, let's not hang about. I'm not exactly thrilled about walking around town with all this murder stationery on us. 
Not only that, if anyone sees us, they'll know we are missing school. You Mr. Know? Hughes. What are you two doing here? Oh, great. Why aren't you at school? Oh, man. Ah, oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, we're just running a bit late. Um, Becky, uh, wanted some company regarding a medical issue. Sure, Nothing whatever serious, that is. just a bit, you know, uh, personal. Right. Thanks, Donna. I take it you got permission to leave the school Oh, premises. my God. I'll make a phone call to your form tutors to check, shall I? Oh, my huh? God. Hang on a second. Oh, for Pete's sake. Family problems. Look, I don't have time for this. Just... Get back to school and we'll talk about this another time. Okay. You've got crap chat. That's your problem. <laughs> yeah? Well, feel free to chip in whenever you want next time. Come on. Let's just get some food and go back. Do you think okay. it would be weird if I asked Vivek out? I mean... Huh? Yeah, he's a sweetie. Would it be weird? I don't think so. Oh man, that would be weird. Oh no, really I did the wrong out. thing. Yeah, I was thinking about it. Just had such a good time with him last night. Shit, I pressed that by mistake. I honestly don't think it's weird. You guys spent so much time What's together. Up? You've gone quiet. Uh, I'm fine. Don't be weird. What's going on? Uh, Sorry, I'm just worried about the stranger and stuff. Oh, yeah. Fair enough. Eh. Shit! We forgot to get Viv anything to eat. Oh, just don't mention it to him. He's probably forgotten anyway. How can he forget it? Wouldn't he be hungry? What the f***? That's so weird. Hey! Donna forgot to get you any food. What the f***, bro? Come on! Hey! We both forgot. <laughs> no worries. Probably should head back anyway. I'll get food at home. Alright. If it's any consolation, we did manage to get hold of a box cutter and a bunch of cable ties. Okay. I guess we can time up a bit more securely. Are we just gonna leave him here? What, what the hell's happening? Okay, he's not going anywhere for now. I mean... Can we be sure he won't bust out of these restraints? Who knows what he's capable of? Yeah, but these are double thick zip ties. I really need to go. Me too. Need to figure out a good excuse where I've been on the way home. Okay, okay. Donna, you okay staying here while we're gone? Yeah, I'll be fine. We'll be back as soon as we can. I just need to make an appearance for Dad. Did he say anything while you were looking after him? Nope. I did try talking to him, but not a word. So he's hey, been hot quiet. Stranger. We're going now. Please don't eat our friends. What the f? <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, see you guys later. Oh, that is so fucking cool, right, man. Come on. Come on, Viv. Okay, so I'm all alone with him. I don't know if I like this. It's late in the night. Oh, great. Okay. Man. Eh. Oh, this is stupid. We should have just called the police last night. Probably would have got away with a caution, maybe an asbo at most. I think that ship sailed now, hasn't it? What do you think? I mean, I'm hitting air right now. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. You're gonna be quiet the whole time? You've scared of me or something? I don't think we he's scared of us. Honestly, we're gone. just kids. Yeah, that's your plan, isn't it? To hope that I'll feel guilty and set you free. I mean... For what it's worth, I am sorry that you're in this situation. It's not ideal for either of us. Is Becky your friend? Oh, wow. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> Fucking hell. Oh, my God. You spoke. <laughs> Is Becky your friend? I mean, yeah. I mean, do you know Becky? Of course. Uh. What? How? She hit me. Oh my god. She's why I'm with you now. I mean. Oh, I see. Hang on a minute. She was acting in self defense, she was protecting me. Could I stretch my legs a moment? Oh my god. You must think I was born yesterday. I would have asked your friends last night, but they were too deep in their own conversation. I don't know, man. <laughs> what were they talking about? My legs are stiff. <laughs> if I let you walk around a bit, do you think you can be a bit more straightforward with me? I can try. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. All right. Keep your hands where I can see them. No. I don't know if this is a good move. Oh my god. Please don't cut him. Oh god. <laughs> I mean... I'm scared. <laughs> Come on, then. Tell me what I want to know. They were very animated with each other. I mean... That's a little vague. This matters to you, doesn't it? I don't know why we're talking so, about this. what if it does? Do you find it difficult opening up to people? <laughs> what is this, <laughs> Please. I'm getting enough of that from my sister. <laughs> How does he know? You, you mentioned her last night. Of course I did. So you were awake the whole time? No offense, but that's a bit creepy. It is. I'm interested. Uh, that's the sort of thing Emma would say. You two should hang out. Okay. Oh, don't, please. Nice try. She's a cop, so she's not coming anywhere near this place. I see. Okay. Yeah, well, I can't wait until I'm 18. I'm going to move out, get a flat with my friends, you know, not deal with her crap. Sounds like you hate her. No. What? She's my sister. I don't hate her. I just wish she'd give me a little space. She didn't have an older sister nagging her when she was growing up. You'd be better on your own. Oh, thank you. Eh, uh, thanks. What are you saying? I think I'd like to sit down now. All right. Oh. Sure, okay. That was... weird. Maybe he's playing me? I don't know. Question. Of course. Last night, when you made the water glow, what was that? I enjoyed our talk earlier. Come on. That's not an answer. If you promise not to tell anyone, maybe I could show you. Oh God, I don't know, man. <laughs> Go for it. Come a little closer. Oh no. Hey. Come on, what are you waiting for? Uh, are you all right, Donna? I mean, he was just about to show me his superpowers, weren't you? Okay. It's getting a little weird in here. So now you've gone quiet all of a sudden? Because of Becky? But don't worry, she's not going to hurt you. Stop pissing around. It's not funny. We're in some real shit here, Donna. Oh my god, I'm not lying. Viv would have believed me. 
Viv thinks the Queen is a lizard. I don't think that counts for much. Is he on his way? No, I texted to say he was in ship with his dad. Of course he was. I hope he's okay. How long are we <laughs> going to keep this up? Moise is throwing a sick house party tonight. Everyone's going to be there. Well... I guess we should properly talk it through when we're all here. I gotta go, Becky. I'll be back tomorrow. Oh wait, so I'm just leaving her alone with him. I mean, it's okay, I guess. I was alone with him. Hey, Ash. Where is everybody? Your mum was feeling a bit poorly, so took herself to bed. Emma's out at the moment. Okay. Guess I missed everyone then. I had to stay behind after school. I'm shattered. I'm gonna head straight to bed, I think. How was school today? Oh my god. Yeah, it was alright. Pretty good. I thought if you had to stay late, you must have had detention. Oh, come on. Nah, not detention. I just decided to do my homework in the library <laughs> instead. Where's your school bag, Donna? Oh my god. Must have left it somewhere. Oh, I see you've decided to grace us with your presence. Oh my god. She's been doing her homework at school. Apparently. Is mum alright? She's fine. By the way, thanks for cooking dinner tonight. We all really enjoyed Ouch. it. Ouch. Sorry. Oh man. Someone's in a bit of a mood. Uh, perhaps give your sister some space this evening, Donna. I mean... Look, I just asked if Mum was okay. Why are you on my case about it? I've enough to worry about without dealing with you again tonight, Donna. You're late home again. After all the palaver of last night. Oh my god. I was revising for my GCSEs with Vivek. I, I thought you said you were doing your homework. Oh my god. It's always Becky and Vivek beginning to think they matter more to you than your own family. I'm oh, sick of this. I'm going out. Where are you going? Oh, none of your damn business! Oh my god. Ah, oh, damn, bro. Shit is happening. Specs, leave a message. Uh... Just checking in. Uh, hope you're okay. Slight change of plan. I'm heading back over now. I forgot that I'm supposed to run or go somewhere. I'm just chilling there. <laughs> Standing. What? What am I hitting myself at? Oh my god. I'm just running. Trying not to hit anything on the way. Don't hit me. Any cards coming by? Wait, where am I supposed to go? This way? Wow, this camera angle is pretty cool, right? <laughs> Reminds me of those old ass games. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, shit. I thought I was gonna hit that guy. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh. Okay. What are you doing back here? Well, just checking in. Come on, I'll take over. You go to that party. Seriously? Yeah. Go and have fun. Go also, and have fun while I'm like all alone here. Anything interesting happened while I was gone? All alone? Uh, you heard from Viv? I wonder if he can make Moises too. Uh, nope. Don't know. Haven't heard from him in a while. I'll give him a call. Oh, yeah. Phone working now then? What? I mean. <laughs> I tried calling you earlier. Oh, right. 
Yeah, I'd switched it off to save battery. Which is smart, to be honest, you know. We should probably leave our phones on at all times from now on. Okay, Which cool. also is smart, to be See honest. Later. You seem upset. Mm. I'm fine. Is it your sister? I mean... Yes. And that's the last we're going to talk about it. I thought we could continue our conversation from earlier. Why is he only talking to me, though? Like... Okay. Why is he not talking to the others? Here. I'm not your mate. We're not going to be friends at the end of this. So you should be careful about pissing me off right now. Unless you want to see the bottom of that pool. I understand. That was a bit rude, but okay. Good. Donna? Fuck no. This is my knife. You asked me a question yesterday. <laughs> you could have escaped. What are you still doing here? You wanted to see what it is that I can do. Do you still want to see What me? the f Yes. Then loosen my restraints. Don't do it, man. Don't do it. Oh my god. What the f He's all is is he an angel, an alien? What the f is happening? Ash! What are you doing here? I, I had a suspicion you were keeping a secret. Would, oh my it's god. Not what it looks like. it, it's just a game. So I followed you down here, waited outside to see if you'd come out. Oh my god. Just come over here for a moment and we can sort this out. Oh my god. I need to get Emma. Ash, wait! Oh my god, someone stop her! <laughs> Please, Ash! Stop a second! I can explain everything! What the f***? What is happening? What what the f what is ah! happening? What the f is happening? Oh no, what did he do? Are you serious? Oh my god, that was crazy, bro. What do you think? Is he like an alien? Is he like an angel? Is he... Is he what? I don't know. <laughs> that was so freaking weird. Anyway, so I think we're gonna stop it here for today. Because that took a long while, actually. So in the next one, we'll start chapter 3. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. And please subscribe. Bye!